Hello, the Lord has a message for us. He's calling this one, Stay Submerged in Me, message 449. I did dream last night. I remember two of them. In the first dream, I was fighting a demon that was coming uh, to attack my mother and other people. I pushed him and he fell backwards through a window and landed on top of a wrought iron fence that had arrow tips. One of them went through him and he was dead. The next dream I was helping to protect people uh, in this one too and then I needed to take a shower because we were supposed to go somewhere. The bathroom I was in looked like mine now. We have a tub that also has a shower head with a shower curtain. I got into the shower and it was not until I stepped in did I see that the ba there had been a bath ran. I thought nothing of it until I was rinsing my hair and the water level started to rise very fast. I dove down to, I, it got pretty high up, I dove down uh, to pull the stopper and the water drained fine. My daughter came in and looked ready to go. I teased her that she must have been the one that filled the tub and forgot about it, and then we left. What was weird was that not one drop of water fell outside of the tub. And as I was dreaming, I was wondering why nothing had fallen out onto the floor that the shower curtain was able to hold it in. The understanding the Lord gave me was that we are indeed fighting the enemy, and we are to stay submerged in him, in his living water, the Holy Spirit, and keep in prayer for all, as he is using us and our prayers for his glory to fight the evil and to help others. The other night, my husband saw a sword and a dagger, so he's using a lot of us. There's a lot going on that more than we know about. Yes, my children. Stay strong in me. There is no time to waste as there is no time left. And every moment you are in me, you are being made stronger. I am strengthening your faith, trust, and teaching you as to what you need to know. This time is not wasted. It is not in vain that you pray for all souls and that my will be done, as all is to my glory and the benefit of whom love me. And for those you love. If you love me, then you love all of my creation too. And I will use the prayers you pray for them for their benefit as well and bring them home. Do not despair, but find my joy by staying in me, as I am so delighted when you do. This time of waiting is not easy for me either, as I so want to be home with you too. And I do not want to do what I must do very soon. So come to me, my loves, and we'll help each other through, as the time to go home comes closer every moment. Yeshua. He is with us, and he will take us through if we let him. We can either dwell on the fact that we are still here, or go to him and stay in him, and let him take us through. It really is up to us. I believe we're going home soon. I believe he is going to rescue us. And until then, I choose to stay in him and feel his love and find his joy. As I am never happier than when I am with him. God bless you all. And I love you. Take care.